Saturday and I wanted to come on here real quick. I'm actually in the Starbucks line. I'm gonna get coffee for my brother and I. I'm going over to hospice. My grandpa's still stable. His respirations have gone down quite a bit though. So um, just trying to spend as much time with them as possible in this time, of course. A lot of, not a lot of you, but a few of you asked to see my hair when it's just straight. So today I, I washed it last night and I straightened it this morning. I don't really envision wearing it like this very often. Like I rather it curled. Chris actually likes it just straight, but um, I don't know. What do you guys think? I think I prefer, prefer when it's curled. But anyways, I have very minimal makeup on because I'm just going over to hospice. I actually made the mistake of wearing a little mascara today. I haven't been wearing mascara for obvious reasons, but this is waterproof, so hopefully I'll be okay today. And yeah, now I'm just waiting to get some coffee. So today is Monday, and, and it's going to be a tough day. Um, Because my grandpa passed last night. And I prefer not to be sad here on the vlogs, although it might still come through. So that's why I'm telling you about it. And I just want to say that words can't express how much my family and I appreciate your prayers, your love, your well wishes. Um, they mean the world to us, especially Mama B and I. And I read every single one of the comments from last week's vlog and probably didn't comment on many of them because it was very difficult for me. And we were at hospice from Thursday night until Sunday night. And Sunday night he passed um, very peacefully. My mom again was the only one in the room and I say again because that happened with my grandma as well um, I was there all day Friday all day Saturday all day Sunday um, I left for one hour with my brother and he passed then and I know you can probably tell that that's frustrating and hard for me um, but in the same sense the nurse said that a lot of the times they won't pass when children are in their room or their grandchildren or little, like, smaller children. So I was there for him, you know, for the majority of the time. And um, it's been really tough for me, even more so than my grandma's passing. I think it's because it kind of now I don't have either of them, so it makes it a lot tougher. And my grandpa and I have... I guess I have to say had now, had such an amazing relationship and he was my dad. I mean, my stepdad's amazing. My, my dad, my real dad is great too, but my grandpa was a piece of me. Like, yeah, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> you guys know, I think that that came across even with the small amount I talked about him or the very small times he's been on my vlogs, I think you guys know that. We had a very special relationship and I miss him tremendously already. Okay, let's stop talking about it. <laughs> but I just wanted to let you know that I, I like distractions when I am sad when something is making me hurt, I like to distract myself by putting myself into work or something, watching a bunch of Netflix. I don't care what it is. I just like to distract myself and not talk about it. So most likely won't talk about it the remainder of this vlog, unless the funeral is gonna be this week, which I don't think it will be. It will probably be next week. Um, so yeah. Again, thank you so much for your prayers. So let's move on to my makeup because that's why I actually came on here. First of all, let's talk about my lip because I just got this lip in the mail from Octoly for review purposes from Estee Lauder and Octoly. This is one of their pure color love lipsticks. I have not tried these yet and I know that a lot of YouTubers were sent like a whole set of these at one point. I was, I did not. Um, and uh, they were kind of on my wish list for a while. I'm like, you don't need any more lipstick. 
need any lipstick. But I just had to try one. So the packaging is beautiful. I love this. And then the bullet separates, you know, this way. And then the actual, like, bullet itself is kind of squared, which is kind of weird. Um, but it does hug the lips still really nicely. So I have the shade Crazy Beautiful. And it's like a really pretty pinky... Yeah, it's like a, a cooler tone pink, I would say. It's really pretty. And they feel like butter. They feel really nice on the lips. And then um, I have, whoa, buddy, look at that highlight. That's next level. That's St. Amrezy. Or Amrezy, how do you say your name? I don't know. Anastasia Beverly Hills highlight. That's popping. On my eyes, I have Terry, by Terry, Ombre Black Star, Bronze Moon. Like, this is like a um, cream shadow stick. And then I have this Natasha Denona. These two shades where my fingers are in my crease on my lid. Um, that's essentially it. Everything else, CC cream from um, Mary Kay. What a shock, right? Too Faced Better Born This Way. Too Faced Born This Way Concealer. Um, the Balm. The new um, brow from them. That's essentially it. So I'm planning on filming for you guys right now. I'm going to film how I curl my hair, and that's why it's like straight right now, and I pinned it up to get it out of my way. So I'm going to get changed real quick and film that. And then I'm going to be going to help Mama be. Hey, guys. So I filmed the hair tutorial for you. Yay. It's going to already be up by the time you're watching this vlog. Can I vlog you? Sure. Mama okay. Bee's with me. Hi, everybody. Um, we're going to do the arrangements and stuff right now, but I just wanted to show you really quick that I filmed for you, and because I know so many of you are asking me, how do you do your hair? It's pretty easy. I just curl it in opposite directions and put some texture spray in it, and that's really it. All right, talk to you guys. I went to Kayway, which I haven't been in forever, and I got the pad thai with the tofu. Mama B got some Japanese shrimp and steak oh, with ramen. ramen noodles. It's spicy too, right? Yeah, it's spicy. It looks good. It is unbelievably bright out. I'm trying to talk to you guys. So um, I just went to my first meeting, not workout session. I'm actually going to work out at home right now um, with PNP Fitness. Will. Will at PNP Fitness. It's off of Williamsfield. It's actually really close to where I do my Mary Kay parties all the time. Can you see the puppy? Like by the bathroom. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited to just get back and be more, um, what's the right word, active. I mean, I have a gym membership and I'm not the best. I haven't been the best at going for the last two weeks. So maybe this will kind of kick me in the butt. Sorry I sound so congested because I am again. Are you sunbathing? Do you see Moose over there? He's right there. He's sunbathing and there's, there's Puddle. All right, I look a little more presentable. I did Bloggerati's today, and it's she has a bride series right now, and I did the butt workout. Oh my God, my buns, my legs are burning. <laughs> and it's only like a 15 minute workout, but it's like doing the moves really repet repetitively. I can't talk. Oh my gosh, is this like not open? Okay, it is. Anyways, I'm off to get my nails done because they are really, really grown out um, because I had to cancel my appointment last Friday. Well, I didn't have to, but I did because of my grandpa, of course. So I'm going to actually get my toes done today, and I haven't gotten my toes done probably in five months. I mean, I've been trimming them myself, okay, but I haven't gotten them like, I haven't gotten a pedicure in that long. Um, so they need some serious help. So I'm going to go do that. I've got to go to the bank. Got to go to the post office. Just got a few errands to do. So I will show you guys my nails after I'm done with my appointment. All right, here are my nails now. They look way better. This is the shade, it's a gel, D&D &D in Cherry Blossom. And I got my toes done too. I don't know if you can see them. 
here they are. <laughs> They're the same color. Yay, it's very Barbie. It's very Barbie pink, I like it. So my roommate is the best. She makes me smoothies sometimes in the morning to make sure that I eat. I'm having mine kind of for a late lunch snack because I've been trying to eat like smaller meals and yeah this has like kale and spinach and strawberries and blueberries and protein and um, some kind of protein pea milk I think she uses that's like lower calorie and high in protein so it tastes really so good. I've kind of been bad about sharing PR packages with you guys. Um, I feel like some of you really love them, some of you don't. So I'll just quickly show you that Fresh did send me a package. Pixie Beauty did as well. And I totally already completely took those apart and gave some goodies to friends. So I'm sorry that I didn't show you that. But this one's from Fresh. It says quench it with rose. And let's see. Oh, I definitely have this already and do enjoy it. It's the Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner. So I'll probably give that gift gift that to somebody. And then we have the Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream. Ooh, I have not tried this. Their packaging is really beautiful. So thank you so much to Fresh. And then I also have my Boxy Charm for this month. So the first thing that I think is so stinking cute is the My Little Pony palette. And this is a collaboration with ColourPop. And I'll take this out in a second to show you guys. And then there is a Dr. Brandt vacuum cleaner. Pore Purifying Mask. I have never tried that before. Both of those are full size. Next, we have the Tartist Pro Glow from Tarte. This is a liquid highlighter and stunner. I own this. This is a full size. It's beautiful, so I'll be putting that in a giveaway. And then we have the High Definition Liquid Lipstick. Oh, I did open this. I forget what the color was, though. Oh, that's a really beautiful color. Odessi, New York. Is that how you say that? Also a full size. I think there's one more thing in here. And then we have the Brow Gal. Light hair number three, tinted brow gel with microfibers. Hmm, I wonder how this compares to Gimme Brow. I'll have to try that out. I think that is all the goodies, yes. So if you guys are interested in BoxyCharm, which is a monthly subscription service, I will leave it linked down below for you. It's definitely my favorite monthly box because it's all full size. It's products that you'll actually use. So definitely a good so one. So I just got the sweetest package on my door from my friends Sam, Daniel, and Ernie. They know me well because like a mango, pink drink. Well, they maybe don't know me too well because I'll probably end up killing this plant. <laughs> but it is very pretty. So glamorous. But this has been my daily routine. Not, not specifically these eye patches. These are from e.l.f. They're the charcoal ones. But I really like the patchology ones. And what are the other ones called? They do puff better than these do. But I'm trying to use all of my eye patches. But yeah, this is what happens when you cry too much and you have puffy eyes like every single day. Yep, my God, am I sweating already? You guys, it has been 96 degrees or higher every single day this week. Mm -hmm. Moose just agreed with me. I don't know if you heard that noise. Mm -hmm. There, you agreed with me again. There they are. My, um, a lot of you have been like curious about my roommate. I haven't vlogged Sadie, just not on purpose. We just haven't vlogged her. But maybe when we have her, we're planning to do like a girls' night in um, sometime, hopefully next week, um, then I'll show you her then. Um, you've seen her in my vlogs in a long time ago, though, like when we used to go out as like, I'm talking about like out, out, like to the club. <laughs> Um, you've seen her then, or seen pictures of her at least, but I'll be sure to vlog her because she is not going to be staying with me for very much longer, so excited for her. She found a great condo, and she's going to be moving out in June, so she'll be with me for another month, but I'm just glad that she, you know, that she was able to um, just have some time to get things together and live with me for a bit, and I even when they're annoying me... <laughs> 
which is rare, but they, I t think I told you guys this, actually I think it was on Snapchat, that they, um, Moose specifically barks at everything, every little noise. So, but I mean, that's, that's just being a pup, right guys? It's just about being a puppy. So, all right, I'm gonna drink my smoothie that's over there, see it? And make some calls for Mary Kay stuff to get ready for next week, because I kind of took this week off of work pretty much. Um, I haven't, except for keeping in touch with my team members and making sure everything's good for them. Um, cause you, you don't take a break when you're a leader. Like you have to be there for your, your team members, you know? So I've still been there for them, but I haven't really been doing any work for me, like doing parties or anything like that. Whoops. So I definitely got to get back in the grind. These beauties just arrived and as time goes by, they're going to bloom and look even more beautiful. Like these roses are going to bud out more, but they're so beautiful, aren't they? I know flowers die, but they do make my day, and they do brighten my day and make me smile. So thank you so much to Brian and Jackie because they gave me these beautiful flowers, and this vase is stunning. It actually has like a glass, a separate glass inside so that this doesn't get tarnished, and it's so, so beautiful. So they brightened my day and they gave me this sweet message. Also, Urban Decay must have known that I needed a little makeup love loving today. <laughs> I got another Urban Decay PR package. I'm, I'm speechless. I don't know how this happened, but I'm very excited that it happened. And this is their new Beached collection. Hello, it has me written all over it. I'm so excited. Okay, first of all, it came in this really cute box with like palm leaves all over it or palm fronds, that's what you call it, right? I know someone's gonna call me out for saying it wrong. What at this packaging? Do you see how the letters are kind of raised? It's so beautiful. Okay, wait for it. It lifts up like this and has a huge mirror. And then look at these colors. Holy moly. <gasps> They're so beautiful. Okay, let's do a little swatch of this. Uh-huh, yes. <gasps> Whoa. Makeup can always make me feel better, I'm telling you guys. Lord have mercy, those are stunning. Okay, look at these. I'm gonna try not to get my lip swatches on. Look at these bullets. Are you kidding me? Aren't they beautiful? I gasped when I opened the packages. And then, can we say glitter mania? Holy, right? So that's kind of like a lip topper. Oh, I just got the shadow on that. But here are the three lipsticks. So that one I just showed you, that's all glittery. It's a clear with glitter, so you can put that on top of others. And then we have Heat Wave, and we have that one that was a sheer, the reddish corally color. And then we have the two liners. Let me swatch some of these shadow sprays. Is the entire palette swatched. You guys. I'm actually really excited for those blues. And then here's the bronzer swatch. I'm gonna try it out today. And the lipsticks and the liner. So, I just finished doing my makeup. It's really dark behind me because um, the sun is setting. I need to fix my hair a little bit. Maybe comb through a few of these curls. But I curled my hair. Um, my lip is actually a combo of the NARS Bound. Um, with the L'Oreal 101 Rose Melody, this lipstick. I just wanted a little more glossiness than this was giving. I love, love, love these, though. They're amazing, like, they're liquid lip ones. Like, they're velvety lip with lips. Um, I just kind of like a sparkly, neutral eye. I tried the new, um, it's not new. New to me. This bronzer out from Urban Decay and Sunkissed, and I really liked it. Um, my highlight is the Anastasia one again, because I'm obsessed with it. It's so beautiful, you guys. Like, look at that. I feel like I need a, ooh, sorry. I feel like I need a blur, blend my contour a little more. Don't want it to be, like, as stark of a line. All right, I gotta get a move on. Anyways, I'm about to go with Mama B to pick up my Aunt Terry and um, cousin Francesca. 
Then I think we're going to go to dinner. I don't know if Brian and the rest of the family, like my dad, is coming with us. Um, I just know that I'm picking them up with her right now, so thought I'd say another quick hi. Do you see the pup back there? I don't know if you can see him. He's right there. <laughs> I'm in the car with Mama V. And I just had to vlog her because I'm so proud of her. Why? She did her hair beautiful. Wow. She did, got her hair done. I don't feel beautiful. Because I scheduled it for her. She would have never done it. I don't feel beautiful. And her nails look as beautiful. And she did her toesies. Right? Yeah. So proud of her. Hey guys, today's the day of the funeral. I don't have mascara on for a reason. I'm wearing my grandma's ring. I'm also going to be wearing my grandpa's medallion later. And then I'm wearing this dress. And... Um, gonna be on our way soon. Good morning, it's Saturday. Excuse the bad lighting. Um, I'm getting some coffee for Mama B and I. And then, don't worry, I'm not looking at you. Um, as I'm vlogging. So I'm getting her some coffee and me, and I just wanted to let you guys know that the funeral went really well yesterday. Um, of course it was extremely sad, but it was good, and Chris came with me and was like ridiculously supportive and amazing, and I'm really thankful for him, and feel very blessed to have him in my life right now. And just really thankful for all my family that is, you know, still here for us. And we also did a lunch at Brio. Um, I obviously didn't vlog any of this because it was just a very emotional day and a very, very, very difficult day for me. Um, I got to wear my grandpa's medallion, though, that he, he wears this, like, chain that he got in Spain a long time ago in 72 with my grandma when they went on their, on a trip together. Um, and he wore it every single day like it was pretty much a part of him so um we had it on him during the funeral and then i wore it the rest of the day and um it just felt like he was with me you know having that piece of him with me all day and um i don't want to wear it all the time just because i don't want to lose it it's it's be very hard to lose though because it's like something you have to put over your head you can't like snap it closed but anyways I'll have to show you it later and then me and Chris ended up going to see the Avengers Infinity War last night with my friend Daniel and Sam and Nida um, so Chris got to meet some of my friends for the first time and we got to see that movie and I liked it a lot there's like one thing about it that I'm not too keen on but it still was really really good and I definitely suggest it if you like those kind of movies um, I still have not seen I Feel Pretty, but Chris said he'll go see it with me at some point, maybe next week, so <laughs> I'll see it soon. All right, guys, I will guess I'll talk to you later if I do anything interesting. You guys, it's about damn time. Mama V is finally getting a new phone. Her phone stopped charging on yeah, her. Yeah, look at me. It's a six. Look at me. Holla. <laughs> and we also got these cool charging docks. You don't have to plug in your phone. You just set it on top of it, and she's getting the fancy red one and this cute Kate Spade case.